Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well and if you're new, welcome. Thank you so much for being here with me today. If you do enjoy this type of content, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you do not miss a video. Today we're going to be covering a case that I actually did not even hear of until recently and upon doing research, there's really not a whole lot about it as well. It's kind of slipped under the radar, but today we're going to be bringing some light to this case. 18-year-old Gavin Smith has just been convicted of murdering his entire family in December 2020, just before Christmas. Although he was just 16 years old at the time, due to the brutality of these crimes, he was tried as an adult. Gavin's mother and father, 37-year-old Daniel Long, 39-year-old Risa Saunders, his 12-year-old brother Gage, and 3-year-old brother Jameson were all found deceased in the home after a relative grew worried and went to go check on the family when he had not heard from them. They had all been shot in the head. Now, Gavin had a girlfriend, 17-year-old Rebecca Walker, and his parents did not approve of their relationship. He had allegedly talked to Rebecca about wanting to kill his family. After committing the crimes, Gavin hid in the woods before sneaking into Rebecca's grandmother's house late at night. Gavin was later arrested and charged with four counts of first-degree murder. Rebecca Walker was also arrested and charged with murder after the police discovered that she not only knew that the murders were going to happen, but was also on video chats with Gavin while he committed them, even though she said that the screen allegedly went black before it happened. There was even a point where Rebecca had admitted to saying that she told Gavin to hurry up and do it. Rebecca also told the police that she could hear the three-year-old boy crying in the background. How unbelievably heartless. Rebecca Walker was sentenced to 10 years in prison in September 2021 in exchange for her testimony against Gavin Smith. In her testimony, she admitted that the motive behind the murders was that so the two could be together. The defense team tried to paint Gavin as an abused teen whose parents put padlock on the doors and refrigerator. The prosecution team soon shut this down, stating that Gavin often ran away and would be brought home by the police as a result. I also wonder if because there was a three-year-old boy in the home that there was a chance that things were baby-proofed due to safety reasons. Not only that, but the victim's own girlfriend's testimony also sealed his fate. Investigators reported that the three-year-old child was found under a mattress and that Gavin had lifted up the mattress where the child was hiding and shot him. On December 8th, Gavin Smith was found guilty on all charges. He will be sentenced in January of 2023. That was a lot, you guys, especially the part about the little boy. I mean, it's just, ugh, that one was hard for me. And I'm so surprised that this is not more known about. This is an insanely huge crime. But for some reason, I'm just hearing about it now. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have heard about this case. I look forward to seeing him being sentenced. And I really do hope that it's going to be life in prison. But I'm pretty sure that that's exactly what it's going to be. There's just no excuse for committing such a gruesome crime and all for somebody that you are most likely not even going to be speaking to in five years from now. Kids, I know young love is, it seems like it's everything right now, heartbreak, it sucks, but I'm telling you right now, nine times out of ten these days, you're not even going to be speaking to half the people that you know right now in five to ten years, so don't do anything stupid. And that brings us to the end of this case today. Let me know in the comments as always what you guys think of this case and I hope you guys have a great few days. We'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new here and love you guys.